Oh, we're back in the office. Oh. Okay. Is the office more or less scary? I think there's something almost a bit like less scary about the office. I mean, it's it's scary having like spooky things happen like in your house, I guess, rather than in a, a strange location, because the house is supposed to be safe. Yeah. James, oh. It's been a while since our last encounter. Wait, how long ago was the last episode? That was a lot of information to absorb. D two days ago. I hope <laughs> something like that. Most of it, but I'll try to summarize the best that I can. You were trying your hardest to get by high school while also taking care of your grandmother, along with holding a part-time job. You sound like a pretty At good person. At the end of high school, you had amazing grades and received a full-ride scholarship. Wow. The only problem was you would have to leave your grandmother to attend college. She raised you all by herself after your parents passed away. It tore you up inside knowing that you would have to abandon her to move forward in your life. Slowly but surely, her condition kept deteriorating. Oh, no. To the point where it was an extreme burden to She needs professional care. Home. That's what she needs. I think so. You had to make a choice. Abandon her and move on with your life. So did he just leave her on the doorstep of a hospital? What, like in a basket? Yeah. To take care of her. Are you ready to find out what choice you Oh, I wonder what choice he made. Is hmm. Exciting, isn't it? Well, um. I won't make you wait any longer. You wait, what? To stay. stay? You felt that it would be wrong to... Oh. Plot twist. Her, especially when she needed you the most. She took care of you when you were abandoned, right? Well, not abandoned. You were just returning the favor. <gasps> if you haven't noticed... This area represents your old job. The one you worked while taking care of your grandmother. After right. First thing you should probably do is sign in. Enter the door to your left and find your ID card. Okay. I'll speak to you soon. Okay, see ya. Good luck. Later, um, buddy. Visitors. But we're not visitors, we work here, right? Door to the left, Tom. He's door to the left. Makes sense. So, is oh, it going to be that we found a out? Disc. Oh, I don't like that. There was like a little like loading jump there. Oh my god! Go in the stall. There's no fucking toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> or flush. Um, oh, that's is that the lid clipping through the wall? I think so. Mm, that's good. Hmm. Very cheap mirrors. Mm. Or someone smeared Vaseline all over them. It's actually modern art. Um, oh. Yeah. You just thought it was a mirror. Oh, God. It's my leg. Are you okay? It's my leg, Tom. What's going on with your leg? It's fine. Oh. Okay. Bzzz. So, is it going to be that we found out that Grandma killed... Oh, look, an ID card. Grandma killed our parents, and so now, so we fucking kill Granny, and then we went to hell. I I don't know. Uh, I thought I knew where it was going. I thought we'd we'd leave her. Blink. Oh no. I think. Oh. You don't know what you're doing. You just randomly picked up the first box in front of you. Oh. We didn't organise the boxes. Oh, God. Okay. What? What did that say? Oh, it's just oh. on the other side of the wall. <clears throat> right. So do you have any fun box organising anecdotes? Oh boy, do I ever! James, are you having fun organising those boxes? Not really, but it's not the worst. Why do they just dump them in like random places anyway? If like the place that they have to organise it is like in here. I mean, that's, that's, a, that's a good question. Uh, which one is it? That one. 
Okay, this is a bit more relaxed. Now, because you're focused on this one task. Yeah, Granny's gonna be out there. Is that all we do? Just kind of organize the boxes? It's a full time job. Kind of kind of getting into it though. Imagine how dizzy you get, like picking things up, turning around, going in there, putting it down, turning around. Oh. We missed loads. No, he's saying about one specific one by the desk, maybe. Well. I've got a system, and when we okay. get to it, we'll we'll get to it. Look, if a job's worth doing, it's worth doing well. Yeah. Because a job done poorly is a job done. You got to do done twice. Do the job. Right, right. That's how the saying goes. Is it not one of them? I don't know. Maybe he wasn't actually referring to any. This guy is a fucking asshole. You know it gets tiring and we gave up our scholarship, but... We thought it was the right thing to do. Yeah, we're doing, like, the right thing. What would you do, Simon? Would you stay behind and look after Granny? Oh, God, you're only half done, mate. No, I freaking love boxes. Holy shit. I had no idea you were such a, a box fiend. I'm just like so into this now. Isn't it weird that like you can play something like this as like a computer game? You're holding a box. Oh shit. Oh. Um, box boy. But you'd hate to do it in real life. It's like that. Those like viscera cleanup games and things like that. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? The, well, I guess mm. because like... We're not actually walking backwards and forwards carrying boxes that, you know, a lot of these are probably full of papers and things. Was it worth it? So maybe you just you just got filled with the, the bitterness and hatred. I think that's it. Nana. And then something like pushed us over the edge, which was finding out Granny killed our parents. Or maybe she, maybe she uh, like through Riddlebun into a fire or something. Fuck, man. Holy shit, that would be dark. Huh? A fucking... What a jerk. What an absolute fucking jerk. Um... I don't know. What do you prefer? Taking care of Granny? Or... Is that going to be the next mini game? Yeah, yeah. We've got to shave her legs. Oh, God. She's got a date. She's got a date. We've got to shave his legs as well. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, right. He's just relaying our thoughts. Yeah, he's not actually fucking with you. He's... Fuck. Fuck it. Fuck it. We'll take this one. kind of job they have robots to now. Yeah. Well, man, imagine if we had like a sack truck or something and we could just carry like five boxes at once. Oh my god. That'd be, if this was a game like, you know, Box Stacker Simulator, we'd make like three dollars and you know, when we've got, buy that as when we've got fifteen dollars, we can buy, you know, something that lets us carry more boxes. Yeah. Was it worth it? <gasps> oh, we haven't done all of them, but we've done a lot of them. Uh, we only have to do two more, apparently. Um, Which is, you know, Simon. What? As a little treat, I'll let you choose the last box. Oh, uh, hmm. That white one down there. Oh God. Oh, oh. you actually get it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. Well, 
Nope. Yeah, I'm ready. Do you have to clock out again? Oh. Beep. No. Can I bring a box with me? Can I? Oh, oh my can. God. You're going to keep doing it. Well, it saves me it saves me some work tomorrow. Fifty one. What is this an Easter egg? If you just keep going. Yeah, this is the true message. <laughs> Stacker oh. extraordinaire. Because you know what? If we do a really good job, we might get a promotion, and suddenly we'll be the head of this company. 50 years ago, I started as just a box stacker. I was looking after me old nan. Now look at me. I'm yeah, but head of box corp. I think that's like 40 years down the road. Yeah, that's fine. So, but, you know, I mean, what's the immediate sort of like promotion from this job? Uh, Well, we, we get to be one of the people that just dumps the boxes in here. A box dumper? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Far more lucrative. You get to take it from the van and just launch it into this room. And then some poor fucking sap yeah. has to come along and organise the boxes. Wait, but didn't we... We had, like, the highest grades in our school. We got, a like, a full honours scholarship. Yeah. Surely we could find... find a better job. We clearly have, like, smarts. Yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a very good point. But, I mean, I guess it depends, you know, if he's in this small town that he can't move away from, maybe the employment options are limited. And working for Boxcore as a... Oh, I guess it's steady. Yeah. You know, it's They're not... like the biggest employer. It's like working for Amazon. Oh, no. What? <sighs> oh, Jesus, I can't believe... That we're doing it. I mean, you're committed now. Yeah, you're, that's the problem. Yeah, now you're going to have to do all 180 boxes. I'm sure it's not some fucking awkward to get. Ah, oh, there we go. Uh, it's probably enough to fill this room. James, what are you doing? James, this isn't part of the game. Stop fucking Please, stacking boxes. I'm begging you. Please stop organising the boxes. It's not... You're not supposed to do that, James. You're supposed to be broken. You don't get anything for doing this. He's only getting stronger. Is that a Conan? <laughs> Something like that. We're on the Wheel of Misery, or whatever it's called. Oh, fuck, there's like a... Come on. I need like a auto clicker just to like spam. Uh, oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> Enough clicks, and you know you can pick up any box. Wow, that is that's beautiful. That's that is. Little... I'm gonna post that on r slash get motivated. Inspirational uh, yeah. messages. And. Uh, yeah, just have a picture of a box there. With like like a mountain landscape behind it or something. Okay. Like or maybe like a, an eagle. Oh, an eagle. Yeah. Well, oh, there's still that one over there. What are you up to? Those are just like disappearing now. Oh. If I put the bags on the shelf, they, they just go. Whoa! <laughs> Truly the spookiest mystery of all. Hover box. Come with us, hover box. You have to be packaged safely away. And Jesus. We're almost done. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> What, did you not think those were? Oh, no. I mean, the, the, the bad parts of this game are really boring. And what you've done here is things got interesting, and now you've brought it back down to being boring. Uh, you see, this is, this is where I think you thrive. This is when the true, some of that Simon Lane 
classic charm gets to come I out. I see your true colors shining through. <laughs> exactly. I see your true colors, and that's why I love you. So don't be <laughs> afraid. <laughs> no. Exactly. Like, see, without the box stacking, it's quite difficult to sing it. Like, wrong? Uh... Oh... Uh. Oh, fuck me. Well, what are you doing? Oh, it's piss, piss break time. Yeah. Hello? James, put the box down. Put the bunny back in the box. Put the bunny back in the box. Oh, here we go. But we've still got a fucking box. We're taking this home. This is how we make our money. Oh my god, by stealing from your employer. Wait, Was where that did you get that idea f How? T Tom? What? What? Huh? Ha We've already established that I would not interfere if someone was stealing from the company. Yeah, you wouldn't uh, snitch on them. Because you know what happens to snitches. They get stitches. Exactly. Oh, hello. I'm a box, and I'm full of likes for the Angry Tom channel. Why don't you just crack me open and put them on the videos? Sure. I don't know, we're running out of ideas on things to use. There's not a lot of characters in this game.